Hi, my name is Declan O'Mara, and tonight is the final performance in Beijing Live, so I can't wait to see you down the front, and it's going to be a great night. We have reported hearing some bizarre noises. I'm here with Declan, the creator of Invasion Live. So hello Declan. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? Yeah, not too bad, thank you. Um, so can you tell us a bit like, what is uh, Invasion Live? It's a three, on paper, it's like a 3D projection mapping show, which incorporates like live um, DJing and music and that kind of stuff with some uh, kind of 3D projection images for the rig that we've got. So uh, it's really hard to explain to people that have never heard of it before. So um, it's kind of like a, a 3D light show in a sense of uh, just being quite broad about it. Um, so how did you like come up with the idea? Um, it came uh, that came up with the idea for Invasion Live was about um, I think it was in a third year lecture or maybe a second year lecture. Uh, so I just did my first um, projection mapping show, which was like a, just on a couple of cardboard boxes and that kind of thing. And I was like um, just doodling. I think I wasn't paying too much attention to the lecture. I probably should have done. <laughs> and um, yeah, I just did this doodle, and it was like um, just that kind of V um, or W shape of the rig, and I was like, it would be really cool to kind of projection map on some kind of more 3D stuff. So then I spoke to a couple of guys about the project and that kind of stuff, and I was like, why don't you just do it? So I was like, um, yeah, we'll just set it off. But it was never intended to be as big as it as it was, from getting like all the support and going into like these kind of venues. So yeah, it just kind of took off really. Um, do you have any advice for like if anyone um, watching has any ideas that they want to make? Um, if you've got any ideas, and just I suggest just going for it. Like um, there's quite a lot of people that will have a good idea and then they'll never tell anybody about it. Or they won't do anything about it just because of like um, they might not think it's too good or all that kind of thing. But yeah, if you just push your ideas out, like um, it's not going to hurt anyone. The worst thing that's going to happen is someone's not going to like it, but you're making it for yourself, not anybody mm -hmm. else. So yeah, just go for it. So obviously like your job at the minute is quite exciting, um, so what would you say is the best part of it? Um, best part of my job? Uh, I'd say the best part is travelling, mm. so we get to go into all these different countries and performing and that kind of stuff, but then it's got a downside of it is to the like, logistics of travelling, mm. like, I hate airports, <laughs> hate waiting and just long flights and got like, customs and that kind of stuff is like thing. But yeah, I'd say travelling, getting to meet new people and just places where you never thought you'd be. So um, yeah, just start travelling, really meeting new people. So you have um, a performance tonight at the entranceship. Um, mm -hmm. Are there any like secrets that you can tell us like what might happen? Um, secrets of the show? <laughs> Uh, there's a lot of um, pyrotechnics I've never used before, so um, I expect like some really loud bangs and like, uh, I'm going to say pyrotechnics because that could be a broad <laughs> thing, so, like, it could be, god knows what, yeah, <laughs> we've got like pyrotechnics and stuff, um, um, it's pretty much a whole, like a, pretty much a brand new show which has never been seen before, which is like a secret to itself. <laughs>